Hey Pisces, welcome to your June monthly reading. This is a collective reading, so it will not resonate with you all. If it doesn't resonate with you, I encourage you to check your moon and rising sign video on my channel as you may be sitting in that energy. Alternatively, you can also click the link in the description to my Instagram, Chelsea Therese, which I sell online readings through. All right, Pisces, let's see what's happening with for you for June. Let's go. Okay, we've got Libra energy around you. So we have strong Libra energy around you at the moment, Pisces. So you may be dealing with a Libra or you may be about to deal with a Libra, but you have strong Libra energy around you. We also have the number nine, which is the number to release and let go. A chapter in your life is closing. Allow the new one to reopen. Also pay attention for 9 a.m., 9 p.m., as the universe is trying to speak to you through the number nine. Okay, let's get straight into it. We have for your cards, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The seven of pentacles in reverse, which is the energy of feeling like you're working without results. You're feeling really distracted because you're getting no rewards for everything that you're doing. You're being breadcrumbed by someone or breadcrumbed by an energy where they're giving you a little bit, but they're not really fully appreciating your energy for who you are, which is just so unfair because you are working really hard and giving to this person and, or giving to this job. And you are just getting not much back, which is unfair. So you're feeling a little bit discouraged through the start of June. Through the middle of June, there is an energy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There is an energy of um, seven of swords, which is coming clean. Someone's rethinking their approach towards you. They've been deceptive and that's not working they're coming clean about something um but what they're coming clean about is going to cause a fucking huge fight and like i don't even know if they're coming clean because they want to come clean because they're pure or if they're coming clean because they're about to be caught for it so they're just quickly trying to come clean but whatever it is it's causing a lot of of conflict like it's going to be a big fight and it feels like there could be multiple energies involved like they've been talking to other people or doing something with other people that they shouldn't be because it's going to make you feel very competitive Pisces through the end of June through the end of June we have the page of wands for you which is an energy of exploring feeling free not trapped in in a third party situation anymore i do feel like you will be dealing with a cheater because and i do feel like you'll be by the end of june sort of fed up with their energy you'll be like you know what i'm gonna start talking to multiple people as well because if you're if everyone's just treating relationships like a fucking joke then i'm going to have multiple relationships so good on you pisces i really do hope that you do that because there is someone around you that is a big cheater. The hidden energy is that a big ending is coming. And when it does come, you're not going to get much clarity with it. The hidden energy is that you're going to get not much clarity. Because this person is so dishonest. Um, they're unfair and they have no accountability. They take no accountability. They could also be a Scorpio energy. But there they have no accountability um at all but yeah there's a huge change with this and there's a huge ending with it and you've you've had enough of the bullshit pisces you've had enough the advice from the universe for you is don't talk to anyone don't look at anyone you need some fucking time alone and you know why pisces have you eaten? You're acting like a big ass baby. You need to chew it in your belly. Eat a fucking taco. You got a feeling you just can't shake that little voice inside you. Listen to that shit. You're giving away your power. You are a badass. Act like it. You're a bad bitch, Pisces. Believe what you see. Face reality or live in fucking la la land. Choose bravely. 
and what somebody is thinking about you through the month of June Pisces is I wish I had treated you better. We both know I am not the one for you. I know that I crossed a line with you. I want to feel that way again. I feel you leaving me behind. I'm just going to read that one more time, Pisces. So what somebody is thinking about you through the month of June is, I wish I had treated you better. We both know I am not the one for you. I know that I crossed the line with you and I want to feel that way again. I feel you leaving me behind. And then Pisces, for your romance energy through the month of June, we have new love. A new person has stirred your romantic feelings. Stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. Make the effort. Great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take. Okay, Pisces, if you could please like and subscribe, that would be really good to help my channel. If you did want to book a personal reading through my Instagram, Chelsea Therese, I'm sending you so much love and light. Thank you for watching.